In this video I'm going to be showing you how to reclaim back some of your hard drive space by resizing the system volume information folder on a Windows 7 operating system. Now this works in both ways, you can either reclaim back some of the space or you can make it bigger. So if you've not got enough space in your system volume, uh, system volume folder, you can actually make it bigger or take it away. So let's have a little look what we need to do. We need to go to the run box here and put CMD and then we need to right click and then run as administrator. Okay, click yes here. Now we've got our command prompt box open. Okay, so what I want to do here is put VSS admin. Okay, I'll do it nice and slow so you can see what I'm doing. And then put in their list and I'll need to put in shadow storage. Okay, now this gives us all the information that we want to know about our system volume information folder. Okay, so as you can see, we've got the use shadow uh, storage space is 216 megabytes or well, a little bit bigger than that but as you can see it there allocated shadow uh, storage is a 498 and we've also got a uh, maximum shadow storage okay so we've got 1.49 uh, 46 gigabytes so what I can do here now say for instance what I've had reports on is some people are saying that they've got 20 30 gigs of this here or 40 gigs now if you've got a, a laptop that's only got a small uh, small amount of space and you want to claim some of that back you can actually reduce it by resizing this okay but also it works the other way around if you've not got enough space here and you want to allocate a bit more space because you like to have a lot of restore points then you can do that also so what we need to do is type VSS and uh, admin like so and then resize like that and then shadow storage yeah then space then forward slash then on just make sure you get the spaces in there yeah because a lot of people sometimes miss the spaces and it goes wrong uh, so C colon I'm going to do this all lowercase uh, and see if it works okay and then space there and then forward slash and then four then equals then C and then colon Okay, and also watch the colons here because sometimes you do some of these co these ones here and, I've, and I make a mistake. My keyboard is not very responsive. Uh, so space there and I'm going to put another forward slash in there. Then we need max size. Now once we've got the max size in and equals, we can now put um, the size that we want to allocate okay, to our maximum shadow. Uh, storage okay so what we could do here if I wanted to I could actually put in uh, say 5 if I wanted to 5 gigabytes or I could make it free or whatever so I'm just going to put in a smaller figure so a bigger figure of 3 gigabytes now if you want to make it smaller if it's obviously uh, 30 gigabytes or something you can actually reduce it down to 10 or something like whatever you want okay so and then we need to put uh, GB and then we're going to push enter okay now as you can see it's done its thing we're going to have a little look here now. So it says successfully resized the shadow copy storage. So what you want to do now is if you want to have a little look, you can actually go back. Uh, let me just, rather than type that, I might be able to just do this. There we go. So you need to type this in again and you can actually have a look and see what's happened. Okay. So as you can see, it's now changed. It's now allocating three gigabytes of that. Okay. So I hope this has been some use. Yeah, my name is Brian from brightech.co.uk. You can find out more information on my uh, forum there. I've got a lot of other inf uh, good information on other sorts of stuff like uh, virus removal, malware removal, uh, all these sorts of uh, tutorials handwritten on there. So you can actually go over there and uh, catch up with what's been happening. Okay. So hope you enjoyed these videos. Thanks again for watching, guys. Thanks for your support. Keep hitting that subscribe button and rating for all my videos. Thanks again. Bye for now.